Hi, I'm Alar, and I'm the coordinator of Robotics Competitions. Sumo Competition is probably the most popular competition in Robotics. In Sumo, two robots compete against each other. The robot who manages to push the opponent out of the ring gets a point. And the team who's the first one who gets two points is the winner. That's how simple it is. The build of a Sumo robot depends on a specific category. There are seven different categories in Robotics from LEGO Sumo to 3kg Sumo and iRobot Sumo. For different categories, there are some limitations. For say, for LEGO Sumo you can only use original LEGO and high technic parts to make the competition more equal. But the basic build of a robot is still the same. It should have wheels to move, sensors to detect opponents and a weapon to push the opponent out of the ring. The field of a Sumo competition is really simple. It's a black ring with white border. The dimensions of a field depend on a category. All the details about the build of a robot and the sizes of the fields can be found from the rulebook. When programming a Sumo robot, you can choose programming language whichever suits with your hardware. But there are three main parts in a code. First part is detection. You should use your sensors to detect your opponent. Second part is attack. When you've found your opponent, you should start moving towards the opponent and try to push him out of the ring. The third part of the code is defense. During that part of the code, the robot should identify the white border of the Sumo ring and try to avoid being pushed out or accidentally driven out itself. As I said, all the details about different Sumo categories can be found from the rules. And of course, don't forget to like our video, follow us on social media and subscribe our YouTube channel. See you in Robotics! Third part. Yeah.